guys welcome back so today we're going to do a haul um i've been shopping like a lot and i'm really not ashamed of it first i want to address something um we are both currently growing out our eyebrows so i apologize if they may look a little cray cray like you guys can see at my hairs and they're so dark that the most amazing concealer cannot cover them up. I'm very excited. I hope you guys liked it. Um, I'm using natural lighting again. I'm in my bedroom. I haven't filmed in such a long time. I just feel like talking and talking and I don't know. Sometimes I just want to sit in front of the camera and just talk. Is that is that like a bad thing? I don't know. I just I just want to sit and talk. Hey, what's up? How you doing? I don't know. I'm weird like that. But um, we're gonna start. I think I'm just gonna get started with like the random items. Yeah, let's do that first. And the first thing I'm going to show is my water bottle that I got from got this from Target, and I don't. It's this brand, Con, Contigo. I don't know. I say it all Spanish, like like. But um, I really like it, and I found some things that like you can open it from here to put the water in, and then you think this is just the core? No, it's a little. So you can hold on to it and carry it and then look at this I just think that's so cool every time I drink it I'm like ooh, fancy but um yeah I've been trying to drink more water I drink water you know a decent amount of water regularly but like when I'm at work I'm really bad at drinking water because I can only get to like a water fountain during my lunch break so I'm really bad about it, but with this, I just fill it all the way up and I just, you know, drink it throughout the day. And it really, it really helps. I drink at least like three of the, this um, a day and this is like 30 ounces. So I, I like to think I drink a good amount of water. I really like this. This was only like $10 and Target is becoming one of my favorite stores, I'm telling you. My next item is going to be these Sunnies. And I don't even know how I look in these because I just put them on the, in, in the store, but Ooh, oh good hey girl hey but um yeah i got these but you won't guess where i got them from ah, just wait for a minute i got these from the dollar tree this was my recent trip to the dollar store which i got a few things but i don't know if you can see back there a little flower that i made with dollar tree flowers um but yeah, I really enjoy these glasses and they were only a dollar and they were so super cute, right? Super cute and I feel like they fit my face really well and my trip to the dollar store was inspired by um, April Athena 7's Dollar Tree haul and like I feel like, I've, I mean I bought stuff from the Dollar Tree before um, she started making those videos but now I just feel like, oh my god, yeah, you could find some really nice things that I never would have thought about buying sunglasses from the dollar store but when I seen these I was like, psh yeah definitely my next item is a makeup item a nars all day luminous weightless foundation and i'm in the shade medium to santa fe but that foundation is really good love the pump i just used it to the packaging i love everything about it it's what i'm wearing right now my next item is going to be i went to sally's i had to get a couple of uh nail things nail polish remover because i do my own um I do my own mani and pedi at home. So I got these and it's these face sponges. I do this for nail art and I also use this for my makeup. I use this to um, set my under eye concealer or something new that I've been trying and I actually really like I really enjoy these. These are only like two bucks. Can't beat that. My next item is going to be this new palette from L'Oreal and it's called La Palette New 2. They have two they have the nude one and then they have the nude two and the nude one is more like naked one and this one is more like naked if you have you know tried this but it's on my eyes today and they, it is pretty pigmented so yeah really like this so far we'll see how i feel about it you know, a little bit later i don't know um next thing i got is this elf golden bronzer and I heard somebody talk about this. I can't remember who I heard talk about this. But yeah, this is a golden bronzer. And this is what it looks like. Can you guys even see? 
And this is what the packaging looks like if you're wondering. It's only like My free. next items that I got is something that I wasn't expecting. I'm using this today. Most of these I'm using today because I wanted to test them out. But And these are the Wet n Wild Coverall Pressed Powders. I got shade light medium and medium. Super soft. And I, I don't know. These, man. I really hope that they're they last and they're good because these are, these are so soft. You have to go try these, and they're only like three bucks, and then you get buy one get one half off, and that's a seal right there. So definitely check those. My out. next item is this Maybelline Master Conceal concealer in light medium, and a lot of people have been talking about this, and I'm wearing it underneath my eyes today, and surprisingly i have not seen any creasing so and this is a pretty good match for my uh skin tone you know to highlight a little bit and so far so good i mean i don't know normally concealers crease just a tiny bit but this one is not creasing at all so i don't know you may have a new favorite concealer we'll see it's too early to tell right now but oh, favorite concealer um, next thing I got that I have not used, but I'm excited to use it because I will be doing my uh, Mani Petty today, is the Sally Hansen Diamond Strength Diamond Flash Top Coat. Still in the packaging, haven't used it yet. Um, I did open it. it smells a little funky funky, but hopefully it's good. I don't know. I mean, I'm hoping. I've heard good things about, so we'll see. I like my nails to be like, bam, you know? Next couple of things that I got, oh man, I forgot about this, but I did use it on my face, but I forgot that I put it in the bag. Um, is this NYX Angel Veil Primer. Um, I had used this with my LA Girl BB Cream that I'm currently trying out. And the ingredients, I think, for the primer and the BB cream didn't mix well, so my makeup was like slipping and sliding all over the place, so I didn't like that. So I have to try it without this. I haven't tried it yet, but we'll see. And But I did use this with the NARS foundation, and so far, so good. Um, I have been looking for this for forever because every time I went to Ulta, it was sold out, and it was driving me insane because I'm like, oh my god. You stop talking about this so I can go pick it up. Because I was like, man, everybody just wants this. And I'm so lazy. I never remember to call and have them hold it for me. So, And they always tell me, call, we'll hold it for you. And I'm like, I cannot remember to do it. But so far, so good. We'll see. I don't know. The next one, which is what I'm wearing underneath my lash line, is this NYX Prismatic Shadow in Mermaid. Do you see this color? Oh my God. I got this on a recent restock at Ulta and this was the last one. <laughs> I felt so bad because my sister actually wanted one and I called her off on the phone and everything. I was like, oh, they have it. And she was like, oh, okay. Sorry, I got the last one. But, oh my God, this color is so perfect. And I have it. Do you, oh my God, do you see that? Oh, I wish this was like super HD so you guys could like get it, but oh, you guys get the point. This is freaking gorgeous. You need this. The next product is also something that I've been like dying to have, and it's the NYX Intense Butter Gloss in Tres Leches. Oh, gorgeous. Just go swatch it, get it. Gorgeous. It's thick, but it doesn't bother me, you know? Uh, I, don't, I don't mind a thicker gloss as long as it's not like super sticky, which it isn't just a little bit thicker than the other one and I already love the original so no brainer right there the next item I have is this Jordana easy liner lip liner and rose crush it's what I have um, to line my lips today and it's just a, a rosy a rosy color this thing is not going to focus but it's a rosy color. I have it on my lips today. And then I just have like a light nude gloss. And I really actually really like it. I didn't think I was going to like it that much. But I really do like it. Okay. 
one back down. My next one is from, I think, Ulta? Yeah, oh, it's just a couple of the skincare-ish items. I haven't tried this one, and I bought another one, but I did try the other one, and I like it so far. This is the CeraVe Foaming Facial Cleanser. I heard, who did I hear talk about this? Um, Luster Lux on YouTube, Luster Lux. I just started watching her, and she was talking about this, and I was gonna go try it out, and then I went to, I went to CVS and I had it for $15 and I was like, skirt, no. And then I went to Walmart and I had this for $10. And I'm excited so. to try it, so we'll see. Um, the next thing I got, which is what I tried, this is the Pacifica Sea Foam Complete Face Wash and it's supposed to remove makeup, cleanse, and tone with coconut water. It does smell like coconut. It does smell like coconut. It's kind of like a jelly consistency and when you go to squeeze it out a lot tends to squeeze out so when you go just be careful what you squeeze out and like you can get like a dime size even less than a dime and that'll be good it lathers really well it washes doesn't leave it like you know super tight or anything like you can feel that it's cleaning your face and i don't mind the scent the bottle super freaking cute and I really like it. And it's $11, so you know, if you have like the Ulta coupon, like 350 off, you can get this for like seven or eight bucks. So I don't think that's bad. Like this one is obviously like a lot bigger. So if I end up liking this one, I may just buy this one just cause it's bigger and me and my boyfriend use it. But I have a feeling I'm gonna like this better. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. We'll see. There's so much stuff in front of me. It's not this is fun. also from Pacifica. And this is the Dreamy Youth Day and Night Face Cream for all skin types. And the packaging is freaking adorable. The bottle is adorable. It comes with a pump, which is nice. This, I used that on my face today. I like it. And the only thing that I would say is... How do I explain this? It's not thick, but it's it's rich. It doesn't have any SPF, so I don't know, but yeah. We'll see, so far I like it. It is expensive though, it's like 20 bucks, so definitely use a coupon with this, because oh, That is so it for the haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys got any ideas of you know what to buy, some good recommendations. And um, definitely give it a thumbs up if you want another video. Hopefully with my sister joining me this time. I don't know. She'd just be super busy. Like, she got a super busy lifestyle. I don't know. But, um, yeah. I really enjoy filming. And I, I honestly want to film another video, like, right after this. I don't know. I'm in, like, a filming mood. I'm like, oh. comment, subscribe. You know, all that jazz. Any information you guys know will be down below. So, check Anyways, that out. Hope that you guys have an awesome day. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Um, but I don't know what's going on with my hands.